Okay, well, after two successful years in a virtual format, Lexington Public Library Foundation excited to welcome guests in person for their Back to Library Booktacular. Yes, joining us today in studio to talk more about the upcoming event is Paige Smith. Paige, good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having me this morning. Yes. The Booktacular. Yes. Love it. spooky. You yeah. know, and a, like a lot of organizations that did have to do virtual events, you guys have to just be elated to actually be back to this in-person event. Yes, we had a tremendous um, amount of fun with the virtual format. We were able to highlight a lot of unique programs. Okay. So we're trying to incorporate that, but we are really thrilled oh, to be yeah. back in our library, at our library for this event. So. It, Guests are in for a fun time. Yes. Okay, so describe to us, let's say there's someone out there who has never been to the Booktacular. Sure. What exactly is it? Well, this year's theme is Back to the Future, so we expect mm. lots of Marty McFly's and Doc right. Brown's, maybe some <gasps> Biff for Lorraine, mm. I don't know. <laughs> um, <laughs> so we have a silent auction as well, and we've got a DJ, we've got some tarot card readings so folks can come predict their future. And, and folks are being dropped off in the parking lot at 88 miles per hour. Yes, That's exactly. crazy. Exactly. exactly. Our auction closes at exactly 10.04 when the lightning will strike. Oh, I love that. Yeah, we've love had a lot of fun it. pulling the films. We're actually going to show the first film in our Farish Theater. So folks will have a really good time. That's yeah. awesome. And so really, what's just been the overall purpose behind this event? What do you hope people take yeah. away when they the come The Library to the Foundation supports the library. So all the funds raised through this event will support education and workforce development programs. So okay. a lot of the fun programs, this month is Teentober. Mm -hmm. So a lot of our programming is geared towards teens. But the library is here to support people no matter where they are in their education journey from birth to adulthood. So if you want to learn a new hobby, you can check out one of our maker spaces. We've got a lot of workforce development programs. So if you're looking to learn a new skill to get a new job, this is what these funds will support. And you guys did yeah. such a great job of the transitioning to virtual, but yeah. there's so much more, I think. And you yeah. guys got to be excited about yeah. it. Yeah, I mean, when do you get a chance the to building, come yeah. party in the library? Right. <laughs> Come dance in Central. Lee has tried before and they kick him out yeah, consistently. Sorry about that. <laughs> He's always dancing there in the well, literature. Yeah, mm -hmm. Dancing, it's welcome. You can come join us. My dancing is lit. That's the hashtag. There you go. I use. I'm so sorry, everyone. Mm -hmm. So sorry. <laughs> but, you know, it is true. You know, because I think sometimes people think in the library like, oh, it's just books for kids or oh, people that God. read read for a hobby. But truly, it is tied to education and workforce mm -hmm. development. People use the library as a resource for so for many so different much. avenues, and not just for education, for fun. We have a new yeah. maker space over at East Side. If you want to, if you've got a side hustle or if you want to learn about mm -hmm. printing or a kiln, um, the Kloiber Steam Lab at Central is introducing middle school kids to VR technology and circuiting we we're there for anyone and if you've not especially during the pandemic if you've not been in our spaces because we were closed for so long we're really inviting people to come back and um, support us and have fun. I recall you guys were helping people start podcasts too right yes we have a digital studio at north side Mm -hmm. They've go. got it all. You can do it all. The yeah. library is moving on up, sticking with the times, <laughs> including this fantastic booktacular event that is in person once again. Time, date, all those good details. Yeah, so it will be October 29th at Central Library, um, but we also have a virtual silent auction that's running now, so we hope that folks will place their bids. We've got a halter from the Triple Crown winner, Justify. <laughs> got some um, Game of Thrones themed scotch. Um, mm. So we have all sorts of things for folks to bid on. So that's mm. live until the 29th she at 10 scotch. Scotch. Yeah. Okay. Place your bids, Lee. Hey, like good to see you. Thanks for having me. Thank all you right. so much. Good luck with the event. It's going to be you. amazing.